this little spot right here. Okay. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Oh, I just saw one. Oh. oh. We are on our way to the super secret spot that I totally knew about all along and I didn't find three hours ago. <laughs> I've been driving around for about two hours now looking for a spot where I can set up to watch and shoot the meteor shower from and bring you along away from like main roads and traffic and away from city lights because this is gonna be the best meteor shower of the year. It's the Perseid meteor shower. It's a pretty nice open area. I think this is a gonna be a pretty cool spot to set up and just watch the meteor shower. This is a nice field right here. They said there's alligators here that we need to watch out for. It'd be quite a shame if we were enjoying the meteor shower and an alligator happened to come up on us. That would really suck. So we're going to watch the Geminid meteor shower. It's the king of meteor showers. We've got some friends here with us. Look at Z. And Chris. Hello. And the puppies. And some puppies. puppies. And Ken. Oh uh, yeah. Have any of you ever seen a meteor shower before? No, not one. Not a single one, Kinsey. No. We have meteor shower virgins. <laughs> <laughs> big fiery balls. <laughs> we're going out to see some big fiery balls down here in Alabama. We'll see you there. <laughs> boys are we're ready. here. The boys are ready. Holy shit. Oh, wow. Oh, I just saw one. You did? Yeah. Oh, dude, this is so good. I'm so excited. Okay, okay. Let's do this. I'm having a hard time <laughs> putting this freaking chair together. I was doing it the wrong way. Really? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, we're not helping. We're just watching. So. It's like uh, when you see people doing construction, there's one guy in the hole and three people yeah, standing yeah, around. Yeah, yeah. We just got here. It is freezing cold. I've got my beanie and I've got gloves on and I got multiple layers. And check this out, check this out. <sighs> Wait, can you see that? Dang it, I'm gonna start setting up. We've seen a couple um, uh, shooting stars just while we've been setting up. So I am ready to get the camera going. Here we go. So I've got my uh, Fujifilm X-T4 camera and right now is there's a 18 to 55 millimeter kit lens. I'm gonna take this off and I'm actually gonna use this Rokinon 12 millimeter lens. One, because it's faster, just means I can get more light and it gives me a wider field of view because I wanna see as many meteors as possible. This one, I might miss a couple on the edges, but if I have that wider field of view, this one's gonna come in handy. So I'm gonna swap that out. One day I'll get it. There we go. <laughs> Doing this with gloves on makes it a bit harder. <laughs> but I got it. We're good. Put this on here. Perfect. All right. What I'm going to be doing is I'm going to actually be taking a time lapse. Just going to be doing a bunch of like 15 to 25 second exposures. I'm going to be pointing towards the constellation Gemini because it's the Gemini meteor shower. So that's where most of the meteors are going to be originating from. They can appear anywhere in the sky, but the best chance at getting one and getting one on camera is if I point in that direction. So I just set up my camera and I'm pointing it towards the constellation Gemini. And there are two bright stars in Gemini called Pollux and Castor. Uh, those are the two main ones that you see, but that's where the meteors are appearing to originate from. They call that the radiant, just a technical term for where the, they look like they're coming from. And really what we're seeing when we see these meteors is little pebbles, little pieces of space dust and rocks. And what happens is as the earth is moving around in its orbit around the sun, there are these little pieces of debris left over from comets or asteroids. 
and the earth runs into them as it goes around the sun. And those little pieces of space dust burn up in the atmosphere so intensely that we see them as shooting stars. And different colors that you see represent different elements that the meteorite is made up of, or the meteor is made up of. Colin just vomited. <laughs> He's only gone and done it. He's a good boy. <laughs>